I said I'm amazed watching Brian combine those colors to make right. it work. I don't know how you do that. He's like a craftsman. That's right. <laughs> it is. Look at that. So, um, I'm here in the Scranton, actually Dunmore is the, Dunmore. Dunmore, near Scranton, and I'm doing a, a portrait of uh, Dave Hawk here. Dave is the uh, president. Well, I used to be the president. I'm kind of semi-retired. Technically, I'm semi-retired, and on my business card it says, favorite title, Grandpa. Grandpa, okay. <laughs> <laughs> the, the grandpa in, in chief here, uh, but he, he's the, uh, the head the, head honcho of, uh, of uh, Gertrude Hawk uh, chocolates, chocolates here, and uh, it's my honor to do a, a portrait. This one that I'm doing is, I'm doing it as a, a study a, a preliminary, uh, it's called an ala prima portrait. It's an Italian term that means at the first, and it's, uh, I've only been working about an hour and a half. But the uh, goal is to do a, a, a larger, uh, a more formal portrait, which will include a, a view of the outside of the uh, building. But uh, right now I'm just sort of <clears throat> doing some of the final uh, touches here. And uh, just as you started here, I was doing something of uh, softening the uh, edges here between the, the shadow and the cheek and uh, and the light part of the uh, of Dave's wonderful dimples. <laughs> He's got a, a wonderful uh, face, so it's been a great to uh, painting. But uh, so what I'm doing is uh, softening it's this transition between uh, the light and the and the dark areas here. And we were talking about Leonardo da Vinci earlier. One of the things he was famous for was the incredible uh, softness of uh, edges uh, and uh, it's, there's an Italian word for it called sfumato. It means a smoky distance. It usually applies to landscape when you think of a landscape with a bluish haze, but it also applies to uh, portraits when you want things to be softer and uh, a gradual transition uh, between uh, areas. And it uh, has this uh, wonderful uh, double light. I've got the spotlight here and the, um, the light that's coming in from the windows. I think it's a nice uh, combination of the, uh, of the two uh, light sources here. Well, I think it's an amazing process to yeah. watch. And, um, and I mean, here too, yeah. And yeah. I want to say, I just can't believe the resemblance between that painting and my husband. <laughs> When I first walked in here, I was, it, it wasn't so apparent, but wow, right now it's, uh, he's getting my husband's face more and more. And, uh, what else can I talk about building up the, uh, the highlights? Uh, it's what's called modeling and developing the form here, and uh, I'll just... Uh, Carolyn, take a look. Yeah, this is... Oh, this is my picture on my phone. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. This is Probably be nice to have. Oh, definition. Isn't it? It looks great. Uh, what I was going to explain here is the, uh, the highlights, uh, and uh, <coughs> like to uh, pop them in, sort of like the the uh, icing on the cake. <laughs> right. You, you wait for that, uh, but the the spotlights are, are bringing out the uh, the form, and so there's one on on his uh, forehead there, and. Uh, and well, there's plenty to my forehead, so. <laughs> <laughs> and there's a nice one on the cheek there, too. But they added, the highlights are like at the uh, the closest places to it, so the, the place where the uh, light is being uh, uh, caught. Also. And that's the, the main ones, I guess, some over here, too. But it's uh, just a, a study, I mean, I could go on for a couple more hours, but I think I'm getting close to, to where I want it to be. Uh, just sort of getting the, the essence of the, of the portrait. Uh. So interesting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think we had one of the boys have a baseball game tonight. Oh, boy. Oh. <laughs> so for it. So you guys want to come? Ben and Max are playing. Okay. okay. Do you want to watch yeah. six years old? And where is it? Is it down here? At Odd Monroe Park. Across from where the old car shop was. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> what time is it, Carol? It's at uh, five thirty. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a good night. Like it's a good night. I'm planning on Hey, it'll be beautiful out. <laughs> um, I said the ultimate goal is to do a, a more formal portrait, and that portrait will be part of Dave's retirement ceremony, is that right? 
and that's going to be on uh, June, end of June, and and the, the portrait will go in that room, the boardroom over there. Eventually, <laughs> it's going to be where it will be. Or maybe I don't know if it's not about the light. Here we go. This is an, an area that I can uh, soften. So this is Brian Keeler, and he's painting Dave's portrait. Very, very nice. We talked about the, the color, but I was explaining to Dave that the more important than the color is often the, uh, the tone or the value. There's a word uh, that we use, uh, value, it basically means it's light and dark. But I am going to put in some chroma here. He has nice uh, color in his cheek, so put in a little here. note of uh, color of red there. Just a tad, <laughs> titch. Yeah, he does have nice focus. <laughs> <laughs> Someone, everyone should do it by the time they're 70, right? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'll have you get up and uh, take a look at it while she's still uh, yeah. videotaping something. Oh, sure. Take a look and see what he, what he thinks there. Oops. Wow. I know, that looks. Boy, I can't believe how much you accomplished. It's unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you've got, my, you've got my signature on that. I'll tell you what, you're doing a great job. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, I think that'll do it for this uh, portrait ses session here in uh, Dunmore, Pennsylvania. So come take a look. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. <laughs>